I did say I was going to do a video uh, on uh, Bob Risky and an exclusive that has come out from the Foundation for Investigative Journalism. So please go there and read the, the, the report also there. And this is by Sade Owoyemi. And they say exclusive. Out of the six months Bob Risky spent, uh, Bob Risky, out of the six months, Bob Risky spent only three weeks in Kirikiri prison. Okunaye Idris Olare Wajo, the Nigerian transgender woman, better known as Bob Risky, spent only three weeks in prison after receiving a six month sentencing for never abuse in April, FIJ can report. On Tuesday, Martin Vincent Ose, a social media user predominantly known as Very Dark Man, released a phone conversation during which Bob Risky confessed to serving her term outside the prison and paying 15 million naira to have the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission EFCC expunge money laundering from the charges against her. For those who do not have a background of what it is that had happened, so EFCC had, had charged uh, Bob Risky as his uh, popularly known, or she is popularly known for money laundering and also uh, uh, def uh, is it defaming the mutilation of the uh, Naira and stuff like that and then the money laundry charges were dropped money laundry in the sense that okay you're buying houses you're doing this mega mega thing what is it really that you're doing and sometimes you know there's a lot of money uh, laundering that happens in Nigeria corruption they take money from the system they find legal means of putting it through and stuff like that say hey I don't have much on the case but that was part of the case and then what is alleged in this you know audio is the fact that uh, that Bob Risky allegedly was saying that he paid EFCC uh, officials some EFCC officials for them to drop that particular charge which of course had more stringent charge and maybe to just go ahead with the uh, mutilation uh, charge which he pleaded guilty to and he was given six months imprisonment some some people and myself included felt that six months imprisonment was too harsh uh, for him this is some displaying of Nera it's, it's not as if they were tearing Nera Spain of Nera which is something that Nigerians do which is a colorful culture that Nigerians have that's even being transferred to that other people are buying into it now I mean there's a better way to make it that don't remove that culture but then uh, they, they, they say the law had been done that Spain is also you know mutilation and then he had also pleaded guilty and begged for the court to allow him use his uh, social media presence and his influence to be able to teach that me uh, a message and you know surprisingly to a lot of people it seems as if almost as if there was a vendetta against Bob Risky he was charged to court but having been charged to court I'm uh, sorry he was in prison for six months and having been in prison you expect he ought to spend his time in prison that's what the law says that's what the law should be but hey Nigeria will always Niger Nigeriate and it seems he never did the controversy has since attracted renewed attention to corruption in Nigerian prisons with Interior Minister Olubimi Tinji Ojo already ordering an unconditional and comprehensive investigation into the allegation of bribery and corruption within the Nigerian Correctional Service. On Thursday, sources familiar with the matter told FIG that while Bob Risky was indeed taken to Kirikiri in April after her sentencing, she left after just three weeks. Meanwhile, she was only officially released from prison in August, guarded like a president. Bob, Bob spent only three weeks here with us in Kirikiri before she was taken out to another place uh, we don't know. Prison official told FIG. That was where she spent her time. It was an arranged and arranged thing, and money was involved. The source also told FIG how Bob Risky was guarded like a president until she was secretly taken away after three weeks. She received VIP treatment all through. She lived in a special cell. The money she said she paid is actually through no lies. Yes, she paid the money, according to FIJ you know, report. The revelation by the source are in consonance with a 2019 undercover investigation by FIG founder Fisa Yosoyombo, for which he deliberately got himself detained for five days by the prison service, discovering that it was possible to pay money to live in well-furnished apartments inside prison, pay to bring in phones, drugs and sundry at lot items, strike one's name off the prison's records and even live outside the prison while supposedly serving out a jail term. Imagine someone who had committed a crime 
who whose name is, is supposed to be on the on the log on the record that they've committed a crime these are the people that they're not allowed to participate in uh, polity they're not allowed to hold certain offices and whatever they just remove their name and that's why you're wondering why we have a lot of criminals masquerading as poli politicians in nigeria but anyway video call camera on bob Risky. although the prison authorities did not allow bob Risky to mingle freely with other inmates consequently reducing the chances of her eventual disappearance being spotted the prison official told fij about one noteworthy incident there was this day one guy was on a video call with his girlfriend and he suddenly turned the camera on bob Risky. the official said it was deemed an invasion of bob Risky's privacy so as punishment he was locked up in his cell for nearly two months the source added as i said she was heavily guarded so there weren't many of such incidents to point out and she was quietly taken away after three weeks i can understand why bobriski would be heavily guarded because of of course this is someone who is popularly known and there's controversy over the fact that is he still a man is he still a woman this is someone is transgender who has literally altered the body that God has given him, so they, they, will, they will expect some a lot, some hatred from some people, something. So, if he, in terms of keeping him safe in the prison and him being guarded all set, I could, I literally can understand uh, that. But what I can't understand is him not serving the term there. But James Brown visited Bob Risky in prison. Since Jose released the audio, that's a very dark man. Some social media users have been wondering whom James Brown, another cross dresser, met with when she announced on June 8 that she had gone to visit Bob Risky in Kinikiri. By the time James visited, uh, visited Bob Risky was no longer in prison. A source in James' camp told FIJ on Thursday. James went there to see one guy called Vindicate, who had invited her to join in recording a song from prison. The prison authorities liked the idea of a song recorded from prison, so they let her come. I don't know why James lied that she went to see Bob Risky, maybe for clout. I will send you videos of James in prison with the people she went there to do. But have you ever seen just one photo of Bob and James in prison? Why do people lie? And that's why some people feel when someone is talking that they are cloud chasing. No denial from the prison service. The Nigerian Correctional Service has neither denied nor confirmed claims that Bob Risky did not serve her jail term in Kirikiri. However, on Thursday night, the Interior Minister announced that the Civil Defense Correctional Fire and Immigration, Immigration Services Board has suspended two Deputy Controllers of Correction, DCCs, in charge of the Medium Security Custodial Center Kirikiri, Michael Anugwa and Sikiru Adekunle over their own professional conduct in handling the case of Nigeria cross-dresser Idis Okuneye, popularly known as Bob Risky. Announcing the action, Jafaru Ahmed, secretary of the board, said the suspension was done to pave way for further investigation. And we hope this investigation will yield the necessary result and ensure that the rule of law is made to stand in Nigeria and no one is above the law. Thank you so much for watching. My people, were this lady now, somebody way alive for that Nigeria country way. This Aicha useful ability be sunny see she they stand for the truth nothing but the truth yes with uh, me i agree say sometimes we know they agree with what in they do sometimes because you must not agree for what person they do all the time before now me i be person way i not agree with video because that year at the, that time when it just the blast women anything about him, women women yeah women there I not to bad door and die here. You get. No be say I hate to but I not just like her. the way he can the bash with me. But when he comes, I can't see say where he constant puts. Say now the right place, now the right path. Now what he make all of us now constant by him because all of us want the better met of that country. You get. So I shall if you know I shall I shall they if they talk and the way be you know they come out anything not they had anything now so it just be. Whether you like it or not, it will tell you the play truth there. So, guys, I don't know what you guys think about this video way I just give you now. Anything way you think, leave them for the comment section. And please share this video, subscribe to this YouTube channel. God bless you. See you guys in our next update. Bye.